looking back, I didn't ever believe I'd be in the final. I think I have to go with you, Samantha. When I went for the audition, it was my first audition, so I didn't expect anything from it, to be honest. Because in show business, it's a world of rejection, so I just walked in as myself, really, and hoped for the best. Oh, my God, thank you so much. And here I am. <laughs> you could be Nancy. Oh, oh I'm scared. <laughs> I'm excited. First up with 17-year-old Samantha. Show one, the most petrifying experience, because I had to wear hot pants. I saw him dancing there by the record machine. And getting through, I was like, just confused, and I was like, You could still be nervous. I couldn't believe I deserved to be here, and it was, oh, um, oh. The fact that the public have voted for me so many times, that's the whole thing they believed in me before I believed in myself. <laughs> I was quite shy, and I was definitely in my shell. There's nothing behind the eyes that was emotionally empty. Whoa. Working with John did unlock something, and I felt like he'd really helped me to tap into my own emotions, which is something I never did. By hurting you. <laughs> I've got all goosebumps. After I worked with him, I was getting better comments every week. That was emotionally fantastic, fantastic, fantastic! Spectacular. And I was like, my gosh, I'm, I'm improving. I think you're one of our leading contenders. So when I got to sing Defying Gravity, that was the most emotional I felt ever because I did, I believed in myself. I am, I am capable of playing this part. I've improved so much. When someone needs you, you love them so. I feel more confident as a person, so I feel like I can go out there and be me and it will be okay. <laughs> about Samantha. She's the youngest contender. If she won, what would she bring to the role of Nancy? Well, apart from a large male, male audience, uh, <laughs> I, as Liza Minnelli said, uh, having worked with her, I think a lot would depend on Cameron, the director, and the team. She's so young that it would depend, I think, on what could be fashioned from her. I, th I think she has everything there. Um, it's six months to go, of course, before the show, so I think a lot could happen. I know she's got a fantastic top voice, and I think it's all down to what would happen in the time. I truly all right, believe thanks, that. Thanks, Andrew. On our final marks, it's Samantha Barks. <laughs> the 17-year-old Max student is hoping her rendition of Anyone Who Had a Heart will capture yours. Could Samantha be your Nancy? Here's Samantha! Anyone who ever loved could look at me and know that I love you. Anyone who ever dreamed could look at me and know I dream of you. Knowing I love you so, anyone who had a heart would take me. Take you back without you, I'd die, dear. Knowing I
Oh! <laughs> now, Samantha, this week, you, as we, we, we've heard, you worked with a real living legend, Liza yeah. Minnelli. I mean, how inspiring was that for, for tonight's final? I think even just as a, as a person, she's so legendary that she's just inspirational anyway. But I think the way that she's just so passionate about what she does really inspired me, I think. All right, well, let's check in with the panel what they thought. Uh, Denise, you've spoken about Samantha's voice. You said it's one of the best in the competition. Is it the voice of Nancy? Samantha, you definitely have the voice of Nancy. In fact, you have an amazing voice. <laughs> Girls, you've been on the most incredible journey throughout this competition and developed the most, for sure. The only thing I find sometimes, this song in particular, oh, microphone problem, I'm talking to John's. I think um, in this song, sometimes emotionally you sit on the fence a little bit. I think that's just due to the fact, as Andrew said and Cameron said, that you are so young and you haven't lived the lyrics, so you can't really feel them. But if you work with a good director, I'm sure they could bring something out. All right, it. let's check in with long, long-time fan Barry. Uh, what, what did you think of that performance? Well, Samantha, you're young, but you have a very mature talent, in my view. You can <laughs> sing... <laughs> you can... You can sing, you can dance, you can act, and you're reasonably attractive. <laughs> <laughs> I think you have all the attributes of a leading lady. The West End needs you, Samantha. All right. Andrew, could, could Samantha be our Nancy? Well, both Denise and Barry have put it in a different way. Um, but I do think you could be in that. I absolutely do believe you could be. My whole question is going to be, as I said earlier, whether or not you would be able to absorb the direction that you would need and would be able to build up the stamina to do eight shows a week. Mm -hmm. I think you could. It's a heck of a gamble, but mm -hmm. I really think you could make it.